guys and welcome to LSPDFR. Today I'm actually going to be running Highway Patrol and I am going to be in a Chevy Tahoe. Pretty excited. I've driven this car a couple times, but let's go ahead and get ourselves on patrol and hit the streets. One Lincoln 18 dispatch, show me 1041 10 8. Alright, so I'm going to wait for a break in traffic before I jump out here and get on the interstate. I'm actually going to back up, make it a little easier on myself. So I'm going to do a little bit of uh, you know, radar. Attention unit 1, Lincoln 18. We have a criminal resisting arrest in Grande Sonora Desert. Lincoln 18 dispatch. Show me 1097, code 3. We are on our way. Okay, so I think they're actually going to be heading northbound here before too long, so I'm going to go ahead and try to catch up over here. Speed is 78 miles per hour, which means I need to be going faster than that in order to be able to catch up, obviously. That would make sense, right? Alright, so... Get trying to catch up to this motorcycle. Obviously, motorcycles are notorious for being able to get away from law enforcement. Unfortunately, I'm not in the fastest vehicle. I'm not in like a Dodge Charger or anything like I was yesterday. But, oh, he got back on. That's dangerous. There's nobody behind me. Attention, this is dispatch. No further oh, units man. required. All right, show, show. So, it shows code four. I guess they got away. So we're probably going to have an active bolo out for that. As the officer is probably in pursuit. Okay, so I saw this dump truck right here kind of weaving back and forth. And at first I was just going to watch him for a minute, but he has definitely got so he's definitely got something going on. And uh, so I'm going to get him behind him before I initiate. If I can get some of these slow cars to move. Can't really do a whole lot until I get this car to move, uh, you know, cuz I can't just immediately start trying to pull him over until I get in front. But it looks like he might end up trying to uh, accidentally hurting someone, so I'm probably going to have to do this pretty quickly. Because if that truck comes up a little bit faster, he's going to probably get broadsided. Alright, let me go ahead and do that. Why would you stop over here? Come on, right lane, right lane. Come on, come on. All right. Only get 18 dispatch. So show me 1011 out with a dump truck. And can I get a 1028? This plate is 83 Delta Uniform Victor 720. I can't tell how many times it's occupied. Target vehicle license plate 83 David Jeff Union Denali. Victor 720. No 1099. Alright. Go ahead and walk to this side. I don't have to worry about you know, being hit or anything. Of course, I might not be able to talk to him over here, so I might have to get on the other side. Definitely occupied times one. Even though I'm not worried about him running me over, I think I'm still, still going to go behind my vehicle just to be sure. I don't want to 
put anything between me and him. Or put myself between him. Oh, there he goes. It's a good thing, because there's no telling what he would have done. Only get 18. I am 1080 with vehicle pursuit with that uh, tip truck. Can you roll me some additional 32s? Assistance required on the freeway and Santiago Mountain. That's a little excessive, if you ask me. Copy dispatch. We'll assist. All right, dude. I, I think he has been drinking, which makes this a completely different kind of deal than just a regular, you know evading police, evading police and you know, swerving back and forth I and mean, there's definitely something going on so we'll just have to keep following him, see what happens, but I mean at this point he's definitely evading oh no well at least he didn't run anybody over move, move, move I've got some more patrols coming in behind me that's what we need. A uh, bike cop. He's gonna do a lot of good against this dump truck. Alright, so, looks like we are just, oh, oh man. Definitely just 1050 into the wall over there, the barrier. Oh no. No, no, no. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I think he is down. I can't. Really? Really? Alright, so I'm going to come up here just a little bit. I didn't want to be stuck without my vehicle because if he took off running again. Man, I gotta find my pistol. Stay there. Get out of the vehicle, sir. Get out of the vehicle. Get out of the vehicle. Come on. Come on. Out of the get back here. It's like I was talking to my cat there for a second. Get down on the ground. Down on the ground. You gonna put your hands behind your back. Thank you. Jeff Denali. What the world, Jeff? What are you doing out here, man? You know how dangerous that was? Taking off in a, a dump truck. What is up with that? The reg the vehicle's registered to you and everything, and yet you're gonna run from it. What's up? All right, so you're weaving back and forth back there. I just want to double check, really quick, see if you have been drinking or anything. So go ahead, and breathe in this too. Breathe, 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 breathe. All right, you are definitely clear with that. Let's go ahead and do a drug test as well. If not, I don't know what to tell you other than you might need to go to driving school. Okay, so that's exactly why. So you tested positive for cannabis and cocaine, and you decided today was a good idea to go, you decided to go, you know, joyriding with a loaded truck. That's not, you probably made better decisions uh, before today, so I, I really hope that you can you know, think about it from now on because you know having that just isn't Doing that just isn't smart by any means So let's go ahead and put you back in the car I can get you in the back of the car get in the car and behave Great, so I just picked up Alright, so he's in the back of the car. I'm gonna go ahead and close the door. I'm gonna turn my siren off. 
All right, so I'm going to go ahead and call a tow truck. They're going to have to figure out how to get this guy, this, you know, truck down here. I'm not entirely sure what to tell them to do. So, so just, they're going to have to be the ones to deal with that. And I will uh, go ahead and get this guy out of here. We'll go ahead and call a transport up here. I just want to get us out of this little area. Man, I got to start off the patrol with the pursuit. Gotta love it. Love it. Alright, so. Get up here. Alright, Mr. Denali, you know exactly why you are you know, in the back of the car right now and under arrest. At this point, you do have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do can be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided to you by the courts. Do you understand these rights as I have read them to you? All right, Mr. Dolly. Well, at some point, you will be talked to by a investigator to figure out why you were doing what you were doing. But at this time, we'll go ahead and call in a transport so someone can go by and pick you up really quick. Other than that, I hope from now on you make better decisions. All right, man, he's in the back of the car. Gotta love the AI, you know, police officers just park in the middle of the road on the busy, busiest interstate. Alright, while he's stopping traffic, I'm gonna go ahead and sneak back on over here. Alright, so that was interesting. Let's start off with a pursuit. Dispatch calling unit one. Man, I have had so many of these. On, um, Great Ocean Highway. Great Ocean Highway. Lincoln 18, should we 1097? No code. Copy that. Moving right now. 10 4. Alright, so. We'll see what happens. It's just right here, but wow. I don't think there's a reason for that. Alright, dude. The siren. Oh, missed the door. Whoa! Man, almost died, y'all. Almost died. What's up, man? Hey, thanks for coming along. I felt like I needed backup on this one. This video came up on a fixed a and BR camera. Apparently the registered owner is wanted. Uh, you go ahead and take it. I'll just provide backup. Well, what are you... Oh, oh man. Okay. I was shot in the hand. Attention, this is dispatch. We are code four. Shot in the hand. Man. Oh wow, y'all. Let me go ahead and secure the gun. Um, ambulance is in route. Alright, so secure the gun. I gotta block off traffic. Hey. Um, fire truck is responding code 3. Go ahead and stop traffic. Oh gosh, really? Oh my gosh. Oh. That's what I should have been doing is using barriers.
Nah, there's not a whole lot else I can do here. I mean, alright, so he definitely did not make it. He's starting to get to me. All units, code four. I need to run out here at the. That is absolutely disgusting. I mean, there's no way. I mean, there's just no way. Alright, so. Definitely got shot. Looks like a straight through shot, though. I think. Attention, all units. We have a possible burglary, a silent right, well, security alarm triggered in Palato Bay. Units respond code 2. Luckily, I was able to stop traffic after a little bit, but... I don't know where they came from. Alright, so let them get their pictures, and I'll open it back up. That's happening a little more than I would uh, prefer to, to see, but... For some reason, my gun kept locking onto everybody else except for... I need to turn on... turn off free... or turn on free aim. That's what I need to do. All right, so that's all cleared up. So I'll go ahead and open up the free rays. Let people get back on their way. Citizens report a possible 148 on um, Great Ocean Highway. Only get 18. Dispatch, can I get a 1051 now to US Route 1? Alright, go ahead and move my car out of the way. Oh man, nothing worse than having to discharge a weapon. It's not something you aim for, regardless uh, whether it's you know in the game or not. But you know, it's definitely something that happens in real life, just like it does know in a virtual reality type of deal only an 18 dispatch show me 10 8 out with a illegally parked vehicle US route 1 US route 13 Giving this guy a parking ticket, it's definitely not supposed to be here. Uh, so Sonora Freeway, Rakoto, license 63, Tango Sierra, X ray, 464. So I'm going to go ahead and call that in, and in a couple of hours, if it's still here, I'll go ahead and have a tow. I probably need to go ahead and. I think this is like a normal one. I think this is always. Well, no. Go ahead and write one for this as well. I'm gonna go ahead and double check and make sure nobody's around first. Let's see. Alright, so it's definitely just illegally parked, so I'll go ahead and write one for this one as well. Can't park cars on the side, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the window. So a journey with license plate, 62 uniform x-ray whiskey 412. I'm gonna put that there. We have an illegally parked Called vehicle in, in Mount Chiliad. Target vehicle license plate. Uh, oh, I love those lights six, in the car. Two, Union X-ray William 412. Proceed with patrol. So, only like an AT dispatch, show me 10-8, available for calls. Alright guys, so I decided to come ahead and come over here and run a little bit of radar. Speed limit through here is 60, so I've got it marked at 70. So, 
Looks like that uh, fugitive up here was going 73 or 72. That's interesting. It shows two different ones. So I'm gonna wait till I catch up a little more before I you know, just try to pull him over. The headlights are off. All right, man. Time to time for you and I to have a conversation. Truck move. Make an 18 dispatch. Show me 10 and 11 out with a white fugitive license plate. Yeah, this truck so big. Wow. Zero 09 Paul Lima Yankee 167. I get a 1028 on that. Vehicle license plate zero nine Paul Lincoln zero Young one six seven two ten ninety nine. Just call her Miss Sarah. That's a good idea. Looks like it's occupied times one. Hey, didn't I, ma'am? Trooper Parks with the San Andreas Highway Patrol. You know, I stopped you this, tonight. Yeah, you were definitely speeding. You just passed me going 72 and a 60, which means you're going 12 miles and over uh, over the speed limit. Do you have your license registration I can get from you? Get bump. All right, so I'll be right back with you. All right, so I've already run a 1028. I'm going to go ahead and run a 1027. I'm going to do that from the uh, inside of the car. Pedestrian Sarah. All right, she's been stopped three times. Everything seems to be fine. She definitely doesn't look 61 year old, years old. I need to uh, get that face cream that she's using. And uh, see, everything checks out. I'm definitely gonna be writing her a citation. Uh, coop, icy white, speeding between 10 and 15. All right, so that's about it. I mean, there's not a whole lot else, I mean, to really focus on. So I'm going to go ahead and just give her that. She didn't look like she was, you know, drinking or anything like that. So it's just strictly, you know, just speeding. So I'm going to go ahead and give her this ticket. All right, Sarah, so here's the deal. You were speeding 12 over. If it was anything less, I'd probably give you a break. But 12 is, you know, pushing a little bit. Uh, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and hand this over to you. This is not an admission of guilt. It's just strictly saying that you will be at court. So once you sign, if you don't mind going ahead and waiting until I get back to my car before you pull off, I'd greatly appreciate it. Sarah, have a good night. All right, so let Sarah get on her way. Now I've got to figure out what's up with the headlights. I'm not entirely sure. I, I try to adjust. It's my uh, ELS. The blackout mode is the same key as, uh, and I say the key, I'm using a controller. So it's the same button on the controller as it is with trying to blip somebody. So that's what I'm having an issue with. Whenever I try to initiate on somebody, I click the X button and my lights turn off like that because it goes into blackout. Problem is, the ELS, uh, from what I could see when I looked at it, they do not allow you to make changes to that, so we'll see what happens. I might have to look into that a little further. One like an 18, show me 10-8, code 4 in the last call. All right, guys, so the people started disappearing from inside their cars, so I decided to go ahead and let's just end it here. If you like the video, please hit the like button. If you would like to continue to get updates, please hit the subscribe button. Other than that, I will see you guys next episode.